Welcome back everyone, and in addition to the Ryzen 5 5600 6 core CPU, AMD is also readying the Ryzen 5 5600 non-X, which aims to be one of the best mainstream gaming chips under the $500 US mark. Now the report comes via Chinese-based tech outlet through Harukaze 5719, which reports that the ship is expected to launch sometime in 2021. Now before we dig into that, I wanted to thank everyone for being here and ask that you hit that subscribe button and that like Dewey if you are so inclined to do so, as it really does help us out. Now first off, the report talks about the Ryzen 5 5600X, which is a CPU that has been made officially noted by AMD on the 8th of October. The AMD Ryzen 5 5600X features 6 cores and 12 threads with a base clock of 3.7 GHz and a boost clock of 4.6 GHz. Now compared to the Ryzen 5 3600X, the CPU has a 100 MHz lower base clock, but a 100 MHz higher boost clock. The Ryzen 5000 series CPU is also based on the new improved Zen 3 core architecture, featuring a, a more efficient 7 nanometer process node from TSMC. Still based on the chiplet design and comes with a 12 nanometer I.O. die, as that really wasn't any necessary to move that to a lower node, and it keeps costs down for AMD so that these chips didn't go up too terribly much. Now as far as specifications, the CPU does also feature 35 megabytes of total L2 and L3 cache and will feature a single CCD, so a core complex die rather than a dual CCX design where you split across the two CCXs. So that should help with intercore latency quite a bit. Now the CPU will come with a 65 watt TDP and included box cooler in the package with an unfortunate retail price of $299 US, which is up $50 over last generation 6 core X parts. But it is what it is and we'll see what performance looks like. Now during its official presentation, AMD compared the Ryzen 5 5600X to the Intel Core i5 10600K, both of which have a retail price of $299 US. Now the Ryzen 5 5600X is said to offer 19% better single threaded performance per dollar and 20% better multi-threaded performance per dollar and also 13% better gaming performance, at 1080p anyways, per dollar values. Now the source, however, says that the Ryzen 5 5600X has enough muscle to even tackle the 8-core Core i7-10700, which retails for $50 more and has a higher clocks upwards to 4.8 GHz and even more higher power limits than the Ryzen 5 5600X. The Ryzen 5000 series processors also have overclocking enabled, which is only on the K SKUs for the Intel parts. Now the Intel 400 series motherboards do feature power limit adjustments to allow for higher base clocks, but that's not proper overclocking as some users seem to call it these days. Overall, the Ryzen 5 5600X at $299 US price seems to be justifiable if the figures and gaming turn out to be true. But what about that non-X part you're asking? Okay, okay, let's get onto that. Now there is also the AMD Ryzen 5 5600, which is set to launch early next year. The CPU will feature 6 cores and 12 threads and a slightly lower clocks than the 57 or 5600X. The CPU will feature a TDP of 65 watts also, and is said to be a retail price of $200. $20, which is much more palpable and more in line with what we've seen in the past. Now the Ryzen 5 5600 will most definitely feature overclocking capabilities, uh, making the performance figures end up probably close to the Ryzen 5 5600X. If that's the case, then the Ryzen 5 5600 has the potential to become the best mainstream tip for the 2021 season, outpacing the Ryzen 5 3600 and 3600X, which are some of the most popular mainstream gaming processors out in the market to date. Now we'll keep you updated as we hear more about Ryzen 5000 series SKUs leading up to and exceeding going past the launch time. For more on this and other news, follow the link in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.